Hello friends, welcome back to Sherry TV. We have a fun unboxing today. We are going to share the February kind of Valentine's Day Pyravita Bracelet Club subscription and January and February's Ipsy Glam Bag Plus subscriptions. These are good. These are so good. What I love about Ipsy Glam Bag Plus is it's about $25 a month, I believe. There's a link, you can check it out in the description of this video, but it's full size products. So typically the value is really, really high. There's foundation in both of these, full size foundations. And foundations can be over 20 or $25 alone sometimes. So to me, this is a win. That was a big spoiler, but let's open the Pura Vita Bracelet Club. For the last few months, they've allowed us to make a choice of which set of bracelets we wanted. So I chose the very quintessential Valentine's Day stack. Whenever you get your Pura Vita Club stack, it's always three different bracelets for $15 per month. I'm an annual member, so I pay annually and I get a little discount, which is really great. So let me show you the three bracelets. So cute, so pretty, just a nice pink classic bracelet. This is one of their original styles. And then of course they have this really, and I'm getting them tangled up here, this really pretty uh, red bracelet, which red is actually a little bit on the rare side for Pura Vida, and it has the letters love all spelled out. I know that they're not lining up all that beautifully, so it's kind of hard to see. But um, if I were to play with them a little bit, you would see that they say love, love, love. So that's the number two one. And then this darling little metal chain with hearts on it. So this is a really nice one. I love that it's a bit more diverse than some of the um, the other choices that have been offered lately. So I'll put it on and I'll show you what the stack looks like together. It's really cute. And of course, you can kind of like layer these with other bracelets that you've received before from Pura Vida because they all go together really nicely. You can mix and match all you want. It's a lot of fun. The wax on them is always a little bit stiff the first time you go to loosen and tighten them up. So I'm struggling a little bit because it takes a little time for that wax just to kind of soften up. It's all I can do to not grab these with my teeth, but I know, I know I'm not supposed to do that, so I'm trying to be good. Okay, well, it's a little bit difficult to see this, I know, because I'm not super close to the camera, but here is the February stack. Really pretty, I'm glad that I chose this one. I think in February, um, or, the, or in March, the next one, I don't think was a choice. I think everybody is getting the same thing. If you're a member, let me know down in the comments if you notice the same thing. All right, let's take a look at my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus subscription for January. Um, Ipsy Glam Bag Plus comes in a cinch sack every month and the bag is always a little bit different. They do have a great app where when you refer your friends, you get points. And when you review your products, you get points. So make sure that you're doing that. The link that I have for you all in the description of this video actually is a referral link like that where I get points when you use my link, which is really cool. It comes with five premium beauty products, full size. The first item for January is the Daily C Balancing Foam Cleanser. This is four ounces, so this is not a travel size, it's a full size. It is unfortunately taped shut, so I'll try to get that open so I can show this to you all here, but it is really, really shut there. Okay. Alrighty. Here it is. So again, full size. And you do, if you're a Glam Bag Plus member, you do sometimes get to pick a few of your items. So they're going to select a few for you and then you get to select a few. I think that I selected three this past month, which is great. And whenever I get the chance to choose a cleanser, I always do because it's a high value product. So that's awesome. Next up is something that I have used before, but in a different scent. And this is the Cella um, creme violet soothing hand and body butter with lavender and oatmeal and this is a full-size 2.5 ounce which is lovely see I'm telling you guys the value is great then we have another item that I chose this watermelon glow lip pop always love lip balms it's something I tend to pick when I have the opportunity oh this is cute packaging look at this you guys let's give it a sniff very watermelony. So this is nice. Basically kind of like a little chapstick with a heavy scent of watermelon, which I love it. It makes me think of summer. Next up, a concealer. This 
was something I was so excited for because I find myself always running out of concealers. Tiny bit dark for my skin tone, as you can see, it kind of matches my skin tone, but I need it to be a little bit lighter to go under the under eyes. So I was a bit disappointed in the shade that they chose for me on this one. See, it's just not quite light enough, but it will do the trick and it's a full size concealer and I will use it. I might mix it with something like my Bye Bye Under Eye. And then the piece de resistance to this one is just amazing. It is a full-size Laura Geller quench and tint hydrating foundation. I took this one out of the box and gave it a try already because I was so excited about it and wanted to report back to you guys on how it worked. It is a wonderful full-size. It's pretty hydrating, so what I did is I layered it. I actually applied two coats of it to make it a little bit more of a medium foundation coverage type of a product and it worked out great the color was perfect the shade was perfect for me they try to do their best to match your shade based on the beauty profile that you fill out and they did a good job so these five products i'm really really happy with for january and i was so excited about the foundation that i already started using it i'm most intrigued by busting this guy out this cleanser daily c balancing foam cleanser a gentle creamy foam right up my alley, sounds excellent. Okay, next up my February bag and I got to choose a few items in this one as well. And this bag is really cute. Look at the detail on this, little gold lips. They really did a good job. So you can reuse these pouches for whatever you want. I like to use them for hostess gifts. So if I'm not using something I've received in a bag, I might give a bottle of wine and a um, couple of toiletry items or makeup items to a friend in this. A small half, like a split of champagne would also fit really cute in here with a couple of different beauty items in it. So let's see what we have. Five items, of course, as always. Okay. Well, I have to tell you guys, I was over the moon when I saw that they had a First Aid Beauty Fab Gentle Foaming Face Cleanser in there. This is one of my favorite beauty brands and the value on this is crazy good. Full size, 4.5 ounces, and this is for great for sensitive skin. So I got another cleanser by choice. I picked this one. Another excellent brand this month, the Gold Fadden MD Vital Boost even skin tone daily moisturizer. I have moisturizer in every bathroom and every room of my house because it's winter time and my skin is absolutely parched. So I was thrilled to see a high quality moisturizer coming with this, with this month's selection. This was picked for me. This is a set of Farah brushes. It looks like it's a set of three. I can't really tell what type of brushes they are. And honestly, I'm really bad at identifying brushes. I don't know the difference between a contour, a blush, and a powder. I really need to study up on it, but it's a nice brand. I have other Farah brushes and they are great. So that was fun. Again, I didn't choose that one. Next up, the item I did pick that I wanted desperately was the Anastasia, I think I picked this one, Luminous Foundation. This is my first time opening it. The shade is 140N and we're about to see if we think it's a good color for my skin. What do you guys think? Is this a good color? It looks pretty good. Time will tell. It's hard to get to have your beauty box guessing your foundation because it's such an intricate thing, but I am just willing to take that risk to get a full-size foundation in one of these. I'm sure this costs almost as much as the whole bag itself, so I'm thrilled. This next one is a product that I've never tried before. This is a Fluid Brow Gel. My understanding is that it's, an, it's a clear brow gel. It's not colored or anything, so normally I wear a brow product that gives me some color and fills in, so I'm not really sure how I'm gonna feel about using something clear. I guess you just kind of use it to tame your brows. Again, I'm not an expert. If you have any tips for using brow gel, I would love for you to let me know. I'm gonna try to open it, but here it is. Is it clear? Yeah, it's clear, you guys. Look, cute little wand. So great items, let's see here. One, two, three, four, and five. I'm loving both of these. I still stand very much by the fact that Glam Bag Plus is probably one of my favorite subscriptions for getting premium makeup products. And to me, I save money on cosmetics by doing it this way because I'm constantly introduced to new full sizes and I'm not having to go out and buy them, so I am thrilled. Thank you all so very much for watching. Let me know in the comments below what beauty subscriptions you are loving these days. 
And until next time, go do something beautiful.